What is up you guys and welcome back again to Ungeek. My name is Colin and today we have a very special unboxing for you guys. As you can see, I have this ginormous box that was given to us in our HQ today. And I'm really excited to check this out. It is from Sony. Well, you know what it is because it's just about that time. So uh, I can't wait to actually check this out and uh, unbox it for you guys right here. But before I actually do that, if you have not subscribed to our channel, please consider doing so because we're making more and more videos for you guys. Simply click the subscribe button down below, hit the notification bell right beside it so you know when it's up with a new video. Now that we have that out of the way, Let's go on with this. Alright, so before anything else, we'd like to thank our friends from Sony PlayStation Asia for sending this box over. This is for the much-awaited sequel for the hit PlayStation game, Horizon Zero Dawn. Yes, guys, this is the collector's edition of Horizon Forbidden West. And I can't believe we actually have one unit here with us right now. So without further ado, let's just like, let's rip this box open, okay? Let's just do this right come on yeah boom Whew. such a huge box oh my god i'm so excited all right ah Whew. there we go that took a while look at this just look at this box oh it came with a nice card uh, Horizon Forbidden West, it says, Welcome to the Forbidden West. Join Aloy on her journey into uncharted lands to investigate mysterious and deadly blights. In the West, she will meet strange new tribes and encounter even more deadly machines. Together with old friends and new companions, she must brave this new frontier to find the answers she needs to save life on Earth. We want to thank you from the bottom of our hearts for your support and hope you will enjoy this next chapter of Aloy's adventure with love. Gorilla from Gorilla Games. Of course, these are the guys who created Horizon Forbidden West. They're also the same guys who created Horizon uh, Zero Dawn. Let's just check this out. Look at this nice, pristine box. Uh, nice graphic printed here at front. And then, of course, if you turn it around, you have these are iconography or icons of what you are about to find inside. And at the back, you'll have a detailed summary of everything that you're supposed to find inside this box. Okay, so let's just remove this plastic for a bit. All right, so it opens towards the sides like so. And this is actually just a nice graphic sleeve. The actual box is still inside. So I guess what I'd like to do is I'd like to gently push the box out or slide the box out, um, whichever works for you guys. But uh, I kind of don't want to rip the packaging off, of course, if you don't really care about the pristine uh, nature of the packaging or you can just like really literally rip the damn thing off. I kind of don't want to do that because I am a collector. It's going to take a while. Oh. Just gently nudge it and uh, yeah, as you can see, you can see the box already and uh, the other inner box has a nice graphic print to it as well. Hold on. Okay, there we go. See? And this is the actual box within a box. PlayStation exclusives, they love doing that thing. They love, love doing like putting a sleeve over a really nice box already. Again, just to add a bit more drama and a bit more premiumness to it. And uh, of course, you can see this is a hard cardboard box that we have right here. And you have Aloy prominently displayed here. And a couple of the creatures that you can see within the game. This, I believe, is a claw strider. And then you have a sun wing here at the back. Uh, another sun wing here. Horizon Forbidden West logo printed up top. And how you open this is basically you pop the lid up. Oh man. Okay, I'm gonna turn this around. I wanna see this for myself. I believe this is the Tremor Tusk, if I'm not mistaken. This is the Tremor Tusk right here. So let's put the cover or the box cover down for a bit so we have more space in our really, really small table. You know? Kanda! So yeah, so this is basically the meat of the collector's edition package. This really huge tremor tusk here. And uh, of course you have also a to scale 
alloy figurine at the bottom this of course is sort of like a mini statue so you can't really uh, move any parts here but there is some sort of assembly required for the tremor tusk just to build it up in uh, in its full scale and we're gonna do that in a bit but before we actually tackle the huge figurine i'd like to draw your attention to this small very small compartment here at the bottom if you pull it up ba bam so you have here the game in steel case and a mini art book as well so let's check the art book first so these are like all the art stuff concept arts key arts that was used for horizon forbidden west look at that wow look at the scenery it's like amazing so this is like a very small 48 page mini art book and then of course you have the steel case now this does not come with the physical disc anymore I think that's going to be a trend going forward with a lot of the collector's edition. You won't have a physical disc anymore. It kind of sucks. I still kind of want a physical disc. I mean, my PlayStation 5 has a, an optical disc drive, but it does come with a uh, game code for PS4 and PS5. And it also has other DLCs as well. Legacy skin and then uh, new skins for Aloy here. But what we're really after is this huge figure and we are going to be checking this out right now. All right, now to get on with the main event. Now let's uh, take this blister pack out first. Um, I don't know if I want to take the box out first or just this out. Oh, there we go. And let's remove alloy first or alloy first so as you can see there are other parts here for the uh, tremor tusk we're gonna put this down for a bit so we can see the base model first all right okay there we go slide out little guy slide out let's move this first and of course instructions on how to assemble these pieces let's remove them first let's remove them one by one Boom. Ooh. Ah. Okay, so we got the parts out. Let's assemble Tremor Tusk now. Okay, so uh, inside you have a very quick instruction manual. You can actually also download, I guess, a video tutorial on how to do it. But it seems fairly simple enough. It's color coded. So, uh, you know, at the end of each item, you have a color here. Like this one has red. Um, this is yellow. You have one in brown. I think this is green. Yep. All right, you know what? We are going to assemble this through the power of a time lapse. A few moments later. <sighs> that took a while. I will admit I had a hard time on uh, piece number three. But I was able to fit everything in. You just really have to be a little bit more patient with this. And uh, the end result is a gorgeous tremor tusk with a very small alloy here. So what's great with the box is that it also serves as a sort of diorama background that you can put your tremor tusk on, put you in your element, and boom, look at that. So what's great as well with a very small alloy, you can actually do a lot of photo shoots with this. You can shoot it either on her perspective or on the perspective of the Tremor Tusk. It's really up to you. And that's it for this really quick unboxing of the Horizon Forbidden West Collector's Edition Whew. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, PlayStation Asia, for sending this over. We really, really appreciate the support that you guys are giving to us. And we are so happy to be one of the first to actually have this in the Philippines. So uh, what do you guys think? Do you think this collector's edition is worth it? The retail price of this, I believe, is 9,990 pesos here. You can only get it if you pre-ordered it in your uh, favorite retailers uh, like Data Blitz and all the other official retailers of Horizon Forbidden West. Let me know if you're one of the few that actually got this. And there is also a souped up version of this called the Regalia version. It's not this, it's sort of like this, but you know, more colorful, has a lot more stuff. And I believe it also comes with a lot more other trinkets and gadgets for you to play around with. So there we go. Let us know your thoughts down below on the Horizon Forbidden West Collector's Edition. Let us know if you're also super excited to play this game this coming February 18, 2022. And with that, guys, my name is Colin and I will be seeing you on the next one. 
If you want more stories on Horizon Forbidden West, do check out ungeek.ph. We are releasing so much content on it. Please, please, please check us out on Facebook. We're also in Instagram and we're on Twitter, I believe, as well. I'm going to be putting all of those details down below so you can follow us as well. All right, everybody, keep safe, keep healthy, and as always, keep on gaming. Bye-bye, guys. <music>